Every year, ovarian cancer kills more than 14,000 women, but that number can be significantly changed with research, early diagnosis, and treatment. Joining me now is Robin Cohen, the CEO and co-founder of the Sandy Roman Ovarian Cancer Foundation. Robin, thank you so much for taking the time with us this morning. Thank you for having me. Of course, your organization named for someone that is uh, very special to you. Tell us about Sandy Roman and also the work that you do to help women. Yeah, Sandy, I was Sandy Roman's oncology nurse. I took care of her from the moment she was diagnosed with ovarian cancer until the moment she died. And we, after Sandy passed away, I had a lot of fight left in me. So we really created the organization based on what wasn't available to Sandy at the time of her diagnosis to support women and families impacted by the disease and to fund ovarian cancer research. For those unfamiliar with where that research stands right now, uh, could you fill us in on that? Sure. There's no screening test for ovarian cancer. So the focus really is on more treatments for women diagnosed with ovarian cancer and prevention. Gotcha. And this Saturday is the uh, Sandy Sprint Philadelphia 5K Run and Walk. Tell us about it. How can people get involved? Yeah, this is the 20th year of the Sandy Sprint. Um, it's a great community event. It really celebrates the community and unity that is the Sandy Roman Foundation. It's at the Philadelphia Art Museum. Um, people can register online on our website or register the day of the race. It's a great community and very Philadelphia event. We have the Mummers, the Eagles Pep Band, the Philadelphia Boys Choir. So it's just a it's just a great day. When you see the community unite, it gives you the feeling that you can do anything. That's amazing. And we're looking at pictures right now from what seems like a huge event there at the Art Museum steps, rocking those T-shirts, the T-shirts that you've got boxes of all around you right now, Robin. Um, I imagine a lot of the challenge is raising awareness, getting the information out there that there is um, a great need, right? Wait, there is. Yes, definitely. But we really what we did is we really put you know, united the community and gave them a voice and they yeah. really lead us. And, and that's what the, the Sandy Sprint has become. That's great. How many people are you expecting? Thousands. It started in a small wow. gymnasium 20 years ago with under 100 people. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Geez, so that's a lot going on this weekend. That's for sure. All right. Yes, Robin yes. Cohen, <laughs> CEO and co-founder of the Sandy Roman Ovarian Cancer Foundation. Thank you so much for speaking with us this morning. Good luck, too, with the event this Saturday. Thank you so much. Of course. And for more information about the Sandy Roman Ovarian Cancer Foundation and their Sandy Sprint Philadelphia 5K Run and Walk, Saturday, April 27th, just tap the NBC10 app or head to NBC10.com slash findit on 10.